but he doesn't know it. Finally, to continue with our example, let's say the betting on the turn went like this. The big blind checks, middle position checks, button bets, big blind calls, middle position raises, and both players call. Three players each put in $8 for a total of $24, plus the $41 already in the pot brings us up to $65 so far. The river is the final card left in the hand, and usually by this point there are only two or three players left. People have suggested that the river is called the river in an attempt to capture the sentiments found in the expression, cry me a river. The flop really defines a hand, but sometimes two players, who have every reason to see their hands through to the end, get an unpleasant or pleasant surprise on the river. River cards can turn losing hands into winning ones, and vice versa, as we'll see in our example here. That being said, you can't rely on a single card at the end to make your hand, unless you have a very strong draw. Without a strong draw, by the river, you should have folded any hands that you think couldn't win unless a relative miracle happened. Don't bet on miracles. Avoid long-shot gambles. Players who call bets all the way to the 